احرص على ما ينفعك واستعن بالله ولا تعجز seek the help of Allah everything you want to achieve bismillah إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين beautiful verse you alone we worship you alone we seek help from so seek the help of Allah and work hard towards achieving what you know is beneficial for you whether it's a job whether whatever else it is even if it is marriage you want to marry someone work hard to achieve it you need to talk to people you need to strive you need to perhaps try and convince this person that person you need to make sure things are happening go out work achieve perhaps earn something and then you're ready and mashallah the wedding will happen you don't just sit in the morning in the masjid and say oh allah make it easy for me let that uncle come right now and sit next to me and understand what's in my brain and tell me it's okay it's cool it's done that's not going to happen nobody will understand that you're asking for something absurd but you can say, oh Allah, I'm going to go, I'm going to try. Soften the hearts, open the minds. Let them accept me, subhanallah, and help me so that I can sustain myself, my family, and we can have children who will worship you. We will teach them to do the right thing so that when we die, our own children are a sadaqah jariyah and a charity that is continuous for us. Do you know what's a sadaqah jariyah? A charity that outlives you is known as a sadaqah jariyah. A charity, the benefit of which outlives you is a sadaqah jariyah. So if you've invested in your children by spending time with them and teaching them and being with them and you've died and they continue the good, guess what? You continue to get a reward because you invested in something, the reward of which or the benefit of which lasted longer than you. So this is what we need to do, my brothers and sisters. Work hard to achieve that which you believe is beneficial for you. And then the hadith says, وَإِنْ أَصَابَكَ شَيْءٍ لَا تَقُلْ لو أني فعلت كان كذا وكذا فإن لو تفتح باب الشيطان. And according to one narration, عمل الشيطان. The same narration says, once you've tried hard and once you've done what was in your capacity, leave it in the hands of Allah. Then, if something happens or doesn't happen, don't say, oh, if I did it this way, then maybe that wouldn't have happened. And if I didn't do it that way, then perhaps that would have happened. If, 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 if. Don't use the term if because if will open the door of the devil. Shaitan will start tempering with your mind and you become a patient. What type of a patient? You become a person who is confused in your head about the plan of Allah. Let's not let that happen. You tried your best, it didn't happen. No problem, continue. It was better for you and let's move on. You tried your best, it happened better than you expected. MashaAllah, thank Allah, be humble, remain calm. SubhanAllah.